Welcome back, guys, to Dead Time Stories with Ward Fire playing. And, you know, I'm just gonna continue. This is super fun. Oh, dead people. Um, so we're having a problem, right? We want this can, but there's some white dye in it, and I frankly don't know what to get out of there. Because I apparently can't put it here. Oh. Oops. Well, problem solved. Cool. Here we go. Alright. A base of white opens the deal. Oh. Oops. I'm doing that wrong. Add earth to you, the humans heal. Taint the mix with a whiff of hell. Oh. Flower and feather bind the spell. Three beads of crimson lender hue. Stir clockwise thrice to make it true. Air, spirit revealing mixture. Let's go back. Where to, friend? Lalaurie's place. I have the reveal spirit spell. The spell book says to brush the mixture through the air to find the spirits. I think I can guess at some likely places. Oh, there, for example. Oh, they're all around here. Um, oh, there. Come on, I'm clicking you. All right, cool. Oh, 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 I have to click a lot of times. Oh, I see, I have to actually paint them. <laughs> I didn't get that. Cool, I have to actually paint them. Are you? There you are. Paint, 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 paint. Poor guy. Well, all of them poor guys. <laughs> all right, cool. Find some spirits. No spirits. Why are there no spirits? Here's a spirit. Hello. Paint, 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 paint. Give me a lot of spirits here. I need four more. Oh my spirits. Where are you? Here you are. Poor hanging man. Oh, here's another one. Oh, is that Jesse? Maybe not. Well, who's that? And there's one more. There's the last one. Come on, spirit. Where are you? Uh, oh, that's just a boy. Okay. Oh, here's something. There's something here. Yes, yes, there it is. Hello. Come on, spirit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Paint, 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 paint. Yes. All eight spirits are already free. Hey, they're free. Come on. What am I supposed to do now? What? I can't do- Oh, I have to collect them. Um, or, you know, there are pieces here. Alright, cool. What is this creepy purple stuff? Alright. You freed all the spirits. Hurry now. Put the pieces they gave you into the lock. Turn it three times and say, Holy, 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 set the captives free. All right, so we're gonna say, Holy, 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 set the captives free. Um, B, R, where's R? There's no R? You're a R. Oh, you're a K, sorry. Y, A, E, M, S, and H. Turn the lock three times counterclockwise. Okay. One. <coughs> two. Three. 
Has I done something wrong? No! One, two, three. I do thank you for coming, Miss Jessie. Now, any old thing I say is just between us, right? I'll take your secrets to the grave. Good. Now, it's about this certain lady, a Mrs. Anton. She's come here from New York and made quite a spectacle of herself, thinking she's fine in those Paris gowns. Oh, it's not fair. Why should she be invited to all the best parties? What do you want me to do? Well, I want you to curse her. She can die for all I care. If the lady were too sick to go to parties, that would do, yes? I suppose, but it must be for the rest of the season. Doing harm is risky work. The price is $150. That's insane. As you like. Wait, I I can pay you 25 now and the rest when it's done, if she hasn't appeared at any parties. So it shall be. I don't think that was very smart. All right, we got new areas. Um, well, I kind of like Daphne's voice too. I mean, I, obviously I like the New Orleans. Delicious or accents, right? Uh, but no, that Daphne, Daphne Lallery definitely not does not seem to be a nice lady, right? Where shall I take you? We're obviously going to the Cajun Swamp. I see you over there. I reckon you're here about the time I met with Jesse Bowden. Terrible, wicked story. They don't tell you things like that in their history books. Looks like these old swamp devils don't want you to visit. You appease them, and they'll leave. Then you can come on up. Look at the basket in the swamp. Oh, and if you see my blue anole, fetch him for me, will you? Been gone for weeks now. All right, well, another awesome accent. I'm loving, loving these, uh, all the people, all the characters, all the, you know, all the Englishes. And then I saw this scary, ba oh my goodness, we're actually taking the head? Doll head looks really creepy. Yeah, that's one creepy doll's head. That's scary. Looks sad. I wonder what it was. Well, alligators can't really cry, but you know, okay. Um, it was a little crazy. How do you appease a crazy alligator? There's a monster with a mustache. That some tooth on that alligator. Scrawny looking. Something stuck in his head. It looks like a hat. Yeah, it does. Okay. Um. Aconite antidote. All right. Well. Oh, okay. Let's get some blood oranges, cause you know they're full of blood on them. Those alligators are blocking the path. Mambo Marie said something about appeasing these old swamp devils. How do I do that? Oh, I can go here. Yay, dead people! <laughs> ah ha! Dipata, sorry, dude. Okay, perhaps I can find fish those leeches out somehow. Those green things in the clothes are leeches. I. I don't think I have anything to do this with. Um, be back. <laughs> All right. I got clothes. Really? Not even these? Okay. At least attach itself to the fruit. 
toss it into the swamp so it doesn't get in the way. Okay. How do I? But I can't do anything if I'm holding it. Hello. Okay. I threw it in the swamp. Cool. All right, leech. So last leech. Now I can get the fabric safely. The cloth is stuck. Got it. It's a tablecloth. The bird's got a fish but doesn't appear to be eating it. Maybe it's saving it for later? Alright. There's a scene. There was an angry opossum. <laughs> well, yeah, it's called opossum. That's what I'm telling you. Opossum, not just possum. Or maybe it's a difference, you know, they're called opossums somewhere in opossums and other places. I always learned it as opossum. From back when I lived in Australia, yo. In Sydney. No, Melbourne. Sorry, I lived in Melbourne. I lived in Melbourne for two years. I don't really remember much though. I was like two years old. Between two and four. I live in Australia, so you know. I learned the language. Um, I do remember that I didn't get to climb Ayers Rock. Well, mom did. And that was really sucky. I I was just allowed to climb as far, you know, as high up as my dad could reach me. Again, sucked. Because I apparently wanted to go up all the way there. That's, you know, my memory <laughs> of those two years. <laughs> I need a magnet and a spring. Spring is usually not the season. Uh, magnet. Oh, there you are. Okay, cool. Hello. You picked up a magnet. It might be useful later. Probably. Alright, let's go. To mango tree. I don't think I can get there without a boat. No, it seems pretty difficult to get there without a boat. Alright, our kids. I like that we have the uh, chippers, clippers all the time. Oh, here's the boat. Uh. Oh. Oh my goodness. No, 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 no. We just took her washing? And we're making a sail out of it? Just like that? Eh. <laughs> what? What do I- What? Um... Oh, there's no skip button here! How am I supposed to- No! Ho 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 ho! Or what am I- Where am I putting them at? Even? I don't even know where I'm putting them. Like what? Am I supposed to be putting them here? Oh, I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> Game! Why are you so random? <laughs> no skip buttons! Hint, come on. Well, the hints are rather good actually, so. So it's okay. Uh, make a sale. Really, I want a hint now. Click on the boat's post to go to the m make sale puzzle. Okay. Move the fabric items into the sail area and arrange them so that they form one solid wall of fabric that fills the sail's shape. You can rotate items. Oh, with a single click. Notice the ends of each piece and align with the sail shape. Oh, I can rotate. That actually helps a lot. That helps a lot. Okay. Alright, now I get it. Okay, I get it. I get it now. This is totally logical. Kinda. 
Oh, this looks like it belongs there. Alrighty. I'm gonna go with that. Alright. Cool. Oh, I need to sew it. Darn it. Okay, hello. A ba the back of this picture says a clan of Kajuns, so evil they now haunt the swamp as devils. Oh, they're alligators, they mean? Oh. Oh, I need to give them their stuff. Okay. So he was his pipe. That's, um, that's the scrawny dude here. Alright. Alright, I get it. Super cool. Um, where do I go now though? Where do I... Hey wait, I guess the little guy's shy. Maybe he can lure him out with something. Oh, oh, that's the... that's... okay. Magnet. Solely magnetic. No. Let's see if we can, um, go somewhere. Now then, where to next? Well, to Jesse's home, but, you know, if there's anything happening here? No. No, I'm, I'm missing stuff. Okay. Where would you like to go? Cayenne Swamp. The threat is in the compartment in the ringer washer where you got the cloth. You can get a magnet in the hidden object scene near your skeleton. Use the magnet on the cup of tea in Jess's parlor. Oh, now then, yeah! Where to next? That is so clever. Probably why I didn't think of it. That tea must be kept hot by the spirits, but I don't need anything from it anymore. Alright. I where totally did to not think of that. Oh, and now we have an object scene. Right? Cool. I like the hints though. They're like, um, they don't point you, but they're rather informative. So, you know, it's, it's another type of hint system, but, um, I'm liking it. So, I, I don't ha really have any problems with it. And this far into the game, it doesn't really matter that there's no, you know, skip buttons because, um, well, Either, you know, I get you got the puzzles, or the hints are, you know, rather good, so you you understand what you're supposed to do, right? Um, but I can see that it would be a problem not having a skip button, because some people, probably like me, will lose interest, you know. If I click the horse, mirror might, uh, you know, tire if, um... The yellow one wants the mirror. If, you know, they can't get past... They can't get past the, um... Games. Um... Oh, here. Oh, uh, here we go. You combine the needle and threat into a sewing kit. And we also got Ball of Moonshine. Is that like a euphemism for... Is it actual moonshine? Or is it like, uh, uh... Another way of saying, you know, alcohol. Ooh, we totally made ourselves a sale! <gasps> Looky here, it's a scene! Again, another one! A new one! Come on, click those things! Click those correct things, please! Come on, come on, come on, come on. La 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 la, I forgot to talk. Heh. <laughs> or, you know. Ah, uh, bread and jar. Jar and bread. No, there's a pumpkin. Oops. Bread. Bread, bread, bread. Oh, there's a baguette. Got a trumpet! That is going to be useful. But we'll, we'll uh, turn that later. Because now we're going the boat. Ooh.
the bow brought a mango back with it. I re could really use that. So yeah, um, as I said, I'm not reading those because I think they are, uh, they're a little too fast. They're going by a little too fast for me to read aloud. So I'll let you guys read them yourselves. I don't need to take the boat out again. Okay. The blue one wants a trumpet. Okay. Uh, sure. There you go. Oops. Looks like this spirit is satisfied. Well, oh, I'm gonna sew more stuff, and that mango looks like an orange, but okay. What do I... I'm gonna throw a mango on it! No! I can't use it on the bird! Throw it! Throw it! Okay. Oh, okay, we're in Cool. We're getting the lollipop! Maybe not. Oops. No. Come on, stuff. Come on, I'm totally clicking the right stuff. Ooh, that's called an armadillo. Yeah, that was an armadillo. Alright, catfish, pumpkin. I know pumpkin. Catfish. Flipper, knitting needle, and carrot. Can't see, I saw those things before. That I remember. Cana figurines. Now there's an umbrella. See a cane? I don't know. Cane. Oh, there it is. Uh, flipper, knitting needle, flipper, and carrot. Flipper and carrot. Oh, there you are, carrot. Thank you. It, you picked up a lollipop. I think that might might appease this little one. Here we go. Now we can get over here. No, we can't because these two are still left. Oh my goodness. You want some. Oh, you wanted those. Okay. Oh. Okay, moonshine is alcohol. We can reach the porch. Oh, porch. I want the boat hook. Boat hooks are cool. Boat hooks are cool in game. I should place the blue anoli, anoli here. Alright. Oh, maybe it likes mango. Yeah, look at it. One nice ripe mango. Dead. Maybe that's why it was hanging out there, because he wanted to get to the mango tree, right? One hundred fifty dollars. That so is a lot of money. I almost hoped she'd turn me down. She's a snake of a woman. It's an evil job, all right. And don't you forget it. Making someone sick for three months. I was thinking about the snake belly curse. Jesse Bodine. Don't even think about cursing that woman. Ain't no point calling on the law unless you can't get the job done no other way. They might take it to mind that you the one deserve punishment. You're right. Must be in medicine that do the trick just the same. You'll need someone inside the house to slip it to her. I know the maid. And I know the medicine. Fetch me a paper, and I'll write down the name. Oh, I love listening to these people. I really, really love listening to them. Oh, such nice English. Oh my goodness, time is so much up. Um, we will not go to the next area because we will do the next time. Um. And, you know, having too much fun. I uh, hope you guys, you know, are enjoying yourselves, having fun. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun. And, you know, hopefully, you know, you can hear that. Um, but, uh, so yeah. Uh, thank you all for watching. Take care, and I'll see you soon.